ManyChat for Beginners, ManyChat Facebook Messenger Automation Tutorial 2023. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, I have one big question for you and that is if you currently own a Facebook business page and if the answer is yes, then you will definitely be needing to use Chatbox. And you know, you're going to be getting questions like what exactly is the face of Facebook Messenger bot and how you can use it to maximize the use of your Facebook page, for example. So coming up in today's video, you need to stay tuned because if you're not familiar with what uh, a Facebook Messenger bot is basically it's an automated messaging software that uses AI to help you interact with your audience and chatbot allows you to reach your customers directly and communicate with them via Facebook Messenger messaging app like how you would normally communicate with your friends and family okay so basically you have the ability to program the chatbot to ask certain questions to people and you know have different customer resolve problems and resolve questions uh, you can reach a certain goal and not only can you essentially use it for anything like customer service, you can also provide options for the most frequently asked questions like tracking deliveries, booking an appointment, or simply visiting your website. With chatbots, you can set up automated interactive conversations with your customers to guide them with the product selection process to make the necessary purchases because most likely your audience is new to your brand and you can remove that barrier through conversations thereby giving them the confidence to purchase from you. And the software that I'm currently using is called ManyChat. And this is an amazing software for Facebook Messenger chatbots, and they're the best on the market right now. So there are basically three things that I actually use for MetaChat. So number one is selling a product number. Number two is lead generation. And number three is customer service. So in today's uh, tutorial and today's bot, we're going to be seeing that uh, how you're going to set all of this up so to set all of this up you're going to come to manychat.com and click on get started for free okay once you click on get started for free it's going to ask you to sign in with your facebook and whatnot so you're going to make sure to go ahead and do that so obviously go ahead with your facebook messenger obviously and once you go to your facebook messenger it says continue with facebook you can obviously go with your WhatsApp or Instagram or, you know, any other software that you want to fancy and add, but I'm just going to go with these and I'm going to click on continue as you know, my Facebook account. Once we do that, obviously it's going to give us a bot overview of the general, uh, analysis of, uh, you know, the in general output of, uh, the, um, you could say summarized data. Now, once you do that here, it tells you to verify your email address. So you're going to choose the email address that your Facebook is on. And once you do that, basically it says verification has been sent to you. So um, you're going to quickly verify yourself. Okay, the email should reach you pretty quickly. And my code is 803092. Okay, once we've added that, it's going to ask you what type of company do you work for? I'm going to go with business. What team do you work for? I'm going to go marketing. I'm going to go marketing specialist and I'm going to go medium. Once you do that, you're going to click on next. Once you click on next, you're going to come to connecting your Facebook page. So we found two Facebook, uh, you know, pages managed by you. You're going to choose any one. Let's say I'm going to go with this one over here. Okay. And obviously you will need a Facebook page. If you don't have a Facebook page, then it won't really work too well. So once you have a Facebook page, we're going to go ahead and it's going to bring us here. Now there's a pro trial that you can use, but I'm just going to go with a free plan right now. What is the primary purpose of creating your account? There's business use, client needs, personal use, educational, and uh, a whole lot of other things that you can work with. So here you can choose whatever you want to add. You know, there's uh, client needs, personal use. I'm going to go with personal use and click on next. Now, once we click on next, how do you intend to use ManyChat? There's short term, ongoing, both. I'm going to go with both and click on next. Which best describes your intent? I'm going to go with the uh, testing and evaluation for now. Okay. Because obviously you people are also going to test it first of all. And if you like what you see, then obviously you're going to head over on with this. So this is your many chat dashboard. And after you've successfully registered, you'll be re redirected to this dashboard. Now, basically there's different tools and different analytics that you can actually check and see over here. Uh, you can see your active subscribers, you can uh, see your contacts over here, but you know, the main thing is your home section over here where you can get your templates and different insights. Now, 
sometimes you may want to actually see the individual subscribers and if you look under the audiences you're going to find them over there so let's say i'm going to come to growth tools over here that will actually help us to see the new growth tools that we have so if you go on new growth tools you're going to see different things like user clicks a facebook ad user comments on your post these are basically triggers and automations so let's say for example you know user clicks a facebook ad it's going to automatically then give you a message or maybe it's going to give you some different types of uh, things uh different types of uh, inputs you can add new triggers so this is basically how you're going to build up automations then there's live chat and live chat is basically uh you know when someone is messaging your bot and you're live over here you can talk to them by your own as well so that's live chat and uh, that's a pretty terrific place to be and it's a great feature and people like live chat a lot because there's some questions that a chat bot cannot answer so they more prefer talking to a live chat automated person now moving on there's also broadcasting okay and in broadcasting uh, obviously once you have subscribers you can start uh, bringing in the different broadcasts and as you can see it says you need subscribers to broadcast to in messenger and you need to collect subscribers before you can start broadcasting so obviously you can start collecting subscribers by automations and uh, you can also get in contacts so you can get in contacts one by one or you can import them in a bulk matter by creating a marketing channel and obviously you can find that marketing channel down in automation and in automation you have different business use cases for yourself you can use keywords flows sequences rules and a whole lot of other things okay it all depends on your type of work sequence so let's say i'm going to go in flow and i'm going to create a new flow like i recently did it gives us all these things so there's different templates obviously you're going to choose whatever template you want to go with i'm going to go with capture customer data with lead magnet so basically this will set up leads for ourselves okay so for this you're going to go ahead and set up templates you now once you set up templates uh, it's going to, as you can see, it gives us a template lead like that. Now, if message contains, let's say, or if message, you know, I'm just going with message contains, you know, leads or um, let's say Facebook, something like that. Then the condition and message contains, you know what? Yeah, I'm not going to add the condition. So we're going to save that. So obviously we've saved a keyword. So if message contains that, uh, you're going to obviously go ahead and edit some of these steps. So it starts with this over here, and this is how you're gonna start. So this ready to use automation is great fit when using a lead magnet. So if message contains, you know, uh, this thing over here, it creates a message trigger on your messenger. It's gonna create the keyword, it's gonna bring them here. So hi, I'm excited to see that you're interested in learning more about, uh, you know, our software or marketing or, you know, whatever you're offering. Then moving on, you have this page over here where you can edit user inputs. Uh, you can actually ask the user to edit, to enter their information and stuff. And that is how you're going to make your flow of automation. Then you can finally set it live by obviously upgrading your plan. And that is how you're going to be using ManyChat for Facebook Messenger automation. So yeah, that's pretty much about it for this video. Now, if you enjoyed it, please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, let me know down in the comments below and I'll make more for you. Till then, I hope you all have a great day. And that was all from me. Thank you for watching till the end and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.